Harika Bale and I am from Vijayawada, Andhra Pradesh. So I completed my graduation in 2019 in Electrical and Electronics Engineering from Lucky Reddy Bangladesh College of Engineering. I always interested in uh, EV technology so I want to know how these uh, electric vehicles are working. So for that I need some platform to understand how these are working, uh, how EV technology is there, what are its basics. So when I am searching where we can learn all these things, I came across the skill link from social media and Facebook and Instagram I saw some uh, ads. So I am interested in that one because uh, not uh, many platforms are there to learn about the EV so I consulted them. They gave some uh, good info how the course will work, how, what can we learn, what are the other uh, subjects we can learn extra, what are the types of software we can learn. Uh, so they explained everything. Like uh, my side uh, also, I started to searching whether it is available or not. In YouTube, there are many videos of the students, how they got placed, what are their achievements through the scaling. So I uh, went through all these things. So finally, I took the decision to learn through the scaling. When coming to the EV, uh, the most uh, important parts coming to the battery, converters and uh, how we are uh, storing the electrical energy and how we are using, how the vehicle is running uh, with uh, that much efficiency, like all these things are learned here. So when we have to understand how all these work, we have to simulate the whole vehicle. So all these simulations are done in MATLAB. So I learned about the MATLAB and simulating. In college also there will be MATLAB and Simlink uh, like some basics will be there but in the college they won't uh, have that much uh, simulation uh, how like complex projects all those won't be there in the college so in the skilling I get to know about all these complexity how uh, actual company works with the uh, big projects uh, big simulation projects uh, so I all learned in the MATLAB from the skilling. Coming to the projects I have done in the MATLAB, the main part is the electric vehicle. So basic components like uh, motor, uh, battery, how we are using those components, like how they are acting with each other. All these are simulations are made in MATLAB. When coming to the projects I have done, I have designed the battery based electric vehicle. Using this battery, we can uh, simulate how much the life performance of the battery is there. Uh, like uh, how it will get affected in the temperatures like different temperature conditions will be there so how the battery will perform because battery is the main component in the electric vehicle we can't put aside uh, the battery performance so this simulation is made in one of my projects and next coming to next project a basic electric e-rickshaw model is made in my project so in North India, we can see uh, electric e-rickshaw is mostly used for the transportation of passengers from one place to another. Mostly those are also working on the electric uh, battery only. So how this e-vehicle is running with the electricity is made in the project. In this project, uh, when we come, uh, lithium ion battery is the mostly used and with the DC motor and how we are giving the acceleration and braking commands with certain drive cycle so drive cycle may be uh, different from one place to another because based on the traffic conditions we can give different drive cycles so all these simulations are made in the MATLAB only whenever there is specific skill set required by the company uh, on that particular skill set they will train us one company needed embedded programming only in C like this one uh, so they make us prepare uh, by giving like uh, many uh, training programs like uh, many training classes more classes will be there after uh, each classes there will be assessment test so based on the assessment test we can analyze our performance so it is very useful uh, when coming to the actual interview process for myself uh, after clearing the assessment test I got some confidence which made me realize that okay I can attend the interviews for the actual companies 
and even after the assessment test they they give some training programs like uh, how we have to face interview and resume writing so basically um, most of the students will lost their chance in the interviews because of the resume so resume writing is also very important so customer success team always makes a sure to write the resume perfectly uh, whenever there are any mistakes uh, they will inform us to correct it and we are updating the resume for every 2 to 3 weeks and we are sending them and they will again give us some tips to improve them so this is the very good thing from the success team actually uh, in linkedin also some of the students will ask me like uh, is it really reliable or not to join in the skill link i face uh, uh, some some of my friends also asked me so i'm already uh, doing this course i told them maybe uh, if you can like uh, if you can spend most of your time in studying this uh, course it is definitely will be useful for you even if you want to do higher studies based on this course we can definitely get a job